Hey guys, Chris here. So I'm just going to be going over how to set up a little satellite network. So we're going to have a large number of these little uh, little network nodes. And these are going to be placed near the areas you're going to be working. Then you're going to have one main transmitter. And that's going to relay it all the way back to your Kerbal Space Center. Um, so you're going to be placing them in different places. So each little um, node and the main relay will have to have their own little engine, their own power supply, and their own probe node. So once you're done building, just send her up and send her over to your destination. Just fly mission as normal. Just uh, make sure you've got enough power on board. You're going to need to generate power on the way over. Um, all those relays are going to be sucking up power, which is a bit of a problem. So in this example I'm going to be uh, setting up a network around the moon. The moon's a bit closer than you really need to uh, be using a setup like this. It'd be perfect for Juno or somewhere. So when you come in you're going to want to um, set up your orbit and you want your low point of your orbit to be the area you're wanting to deploy little satellite nodes. Um, we're going to set the high point to be roughly where we're going to put our uh, main relay. Your relay is going to want a higher altitude. The reason for this is you're wanting your little network nodes to be close to where you're working, but you want your relay to be a higher altitude so that it isn't in the shadow of the planet or anything uh, too often. So after you've set up your orbit, you deploy your first node and you're then going to uh, use a little engine on it to uh, put it into a nice circular orbit. The good thing about having a uh, lower periapsis than the apoapsis is that uh, when you loop around you're going to be uh, different points in the circular orbit so it means you can uh, just go around and every time you reach the um, Every time you reach the low point, you'll be further away from the other little nodes you've deployed. So you don't have to use any uh, fuel to spread out your little satellite. You just use your time accelerator and you'll get them all spaced out. Once you deploy your little nodes, you're going to want to maneuver your main relay out to um, a higher altitude. So I'm going to try to make it as high as possible. This uh, stops me being in the shadow as often. So it means my relay will be operational as long as possible. So I'm going to take it all the way up. Then I'm going to uh, shift it around to be a roughly circular orbit. 